Hello again guys, I'm Fajar Purnama and if you're using I'm going to try to install uh, something called Bumblebee that might uh, okay that might be able to boost the performance of my of playing games on Linux so this Bumblebee is to okay if you have both Intel and if NVIDIA graphic card in your laptop um, usually your laptop will only use one of the graphic card and maybe the other is just, just as a support but to, to use the NVIDIA with full power you need an uh, application like Bumblebee or Primus but I'm not ready to install Bumblebee yet because I need to consider whether using this driver or this driver for now I'll be installing Primus only but let's see if Bumblebee is actually in here ah. yes there is a Bumblebee but whether for NVIDIA or no AU but for now let's try using just Primus so I need both 32 and 64 bit library due to the games I'm playing needs a 32 bit of library that's one and then the lips uh, why don't I just install all of them okay oh either way I have to install bumblebee and can I install both if, if I can install both then I'll go for NVIDIA okay any packages that will be removed no I can install NVIDIA alongside the NVIDIA but not now I'm going to leave NVIDIA out for later videos okay before I continue to test to test this on your laptop is either you use GLX gears or GLX spears whatever but normally if you just play GLX gears it will only it will only limit up to 16 60 frame per second and around here which is pretty much useless if you want to test a uh, graphic card so to remove that limit I, I google and found to add feeblank mode equals to zero parameter first before running GLX gears and you can as you can see it use uh, 6000 FPS now let's see if after using Primus so basically to use the Primus or Bumblebee just add the word first fee blank then Primus run GLX gears hmm. Mm, so I have to be as a root how annoying okay that sucks
need it start already then will be status it's running up the run gears x gears okay then before that looks like we need to follow this tutorial and blah 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 what come on there should be some sort of okay number b i do remember the steps but i want to show to you bumblebee okay ubuntu should do so what do you need to do okay get from bumblebee resource and then install Okay, there is one error like this. Here, you need to edit the. Uh, here, you need to edit the configuration. Okay, so let us go and edit the configuration. I'm using a gedit. Then it'll be on etc bumblebee. And then I'm using no fee no fau. Mm, it's not colored this script nvidia okay this is only the identifier the driver name is right i maybe let's leave the pci out for for now then let's check the bumblebee.conf okay i'm going to go with gfim yes and this is better bumblebee virtual display i'll leave it as it is okay turn card off exit false okay auto detection for now the NVIDIA B now I need to set whether this one is correct or not okay then let's try changing this to no fee save and then I'm going to try to do a I must run gears uh, x gears and have to be root okay and how about opti run then I'll do primus run later. Mm hmm. Okay, then let's specify the okay, but will be that's all next is the exorphone cough dot t this folder is there is a dummy what's this dummy dummy is empty 
so let's try giving a direct location of the PCI to get the bus ID and use this so just uncomment this line and then search type lspci mean v and then you will see that it, this is the location of the this is the what you call it the bus id so i should write pci 04000 okay and then let's try again of the run yes else gears ah. okay, let's try again restart okay so I'm getting an error then let's try going to the web and what the error actually is okay then in that case let me try rebooting let me try rebooting this laptop i do remember when i run a lspc i mean v the driver in use shouldn't have shown because because it's being replaced by the bumblebee so see you in the next video okay i'm back guys so now I, I just restarted my PC here and now I'm back up so here is the how the LSPCI command looks like if the bumblebee is not yet started now you can just start the bumblebee service and your when after you do LSPCI it will do like this because the bumblebee takes over the command so what you have to do is you have to run primus to run then lspc i mean v it didn't work <laughs> how shame of me okay opti run so the command is opti run and then you can see okay let's go back to doing a v blank zero this one how um, um, how many fps that it shows so around 5000 5000 now what happens if we use optiran Okay, looks like it's smaller. Meaning that it's not successful. And so what I do here
is to touch y of t run gave a smaller fps and i'll be look i forgot where i look at it but i'll tell you when i find it okay guys i'm back so here i found three problems in using primus run but the sad thing is i cannot follow uh, the frame per second fps drop when using primus prime when using bumblebee so first off you need to if you back in my previous video okay just from here if you're as a Legora user and to run Primus Run, you probably get an access denied and you have to be a root user. So first you have to add your user to the Bumblebee group. One way is using this command. And you have to be a root user. then you can run as a leguro user okay the next problem is the next problem is team uh, have this problem here that is uh, what is it Okay, here's the problem. When you try to run promise run with Steam, you'll get a fatal error failed to load Steam UE.SO. So to go around, we, there is a, in some form in Arch Linux is to actually copy the one on your system, this library, into the Steam library. But I didn't do that. What I did is okay so what I did is first I make a backup of this library inside the steam steam ubuntu steam runtime md user lib and blah and make a backup of it and then delete the original and then I don't copy it from the user from from here to here instead I made a link I made a link of this of this library inside the steam inside the steam library folder itself so here is the one I want to make a link and here is first is the location of the library link then is where you want to put the link and then finally you will be able to start steam then next is a uh, type of the run on steam there is one Okay, let's try this one. First, let's check if I already got that package. Primus. What? I didn't have this one. Wait, it might tell me to uninstall the three six. We'll see. Yeah, of course. Already got the library. 
next I need uh, lib32 virtual gl ok lib what? lib32 min virtual gl ok I need to search for virtual Yeah, oh, I don't have here to okay. Ah, wrong code. Virtual, and then virtual GL. I don't have it and so I cannot use okay so the next thing is to put this command into the Dota which I already did promise run command and I'll try to play but yeah before recording this video I already gave it a shot and looks like it didn't work for me as you can see it's already slow and take a look at the thing it's already the fastest Hmm. So I will try one Primus Prime and then Opti Primus Run and then Opti Run. If this doesn't work, then we are going to use the default Prime package installed already on the laptop. So we weren't using any Bumblebee. Um, hello this is to be so long yes it is as you can see the FPS is very low much lower than the one we got the prime is prime so there's no longer any need to continue okay what else the other command that they tell to do is opti run something I forgot is opti run min b Okay, let's search again. Opti run min b. Yeah, I forgot where I put it. I forgot, but I think I remember the command. It was opti run min b primus run or maybe prime primus prime or maybe just primus. Yes. 
is optimal mean b just primus we will try this one okay but you can take a look it's already very low fps this one do so the next step is to try just opti run No, the same thing. So this method doesn't work for me. Since I'm still using the default driver. No VAU. Okay, so for now that's it for the video. And next I will on the next video I will give a different approach not using a bumblebee